Three members of the Altona Police Service hit the gun range in continuation of four days of intensive weapons training. The group was becoming familiar with a trio of Daniel Defense M4 semi-automatic carbine rifles purchased last year through a $15,000 Proceeds of Crime grant. Some may think that these rifles are a bit overboard for a small-town police department. But Corporal Sean Tarnick says, unfortunately, this caliber of weapon is becoming quite necessary. We don't have that quick access to a, an ER team like the RCPF. And in fact, in some cases, it can take up to four to six hours for them to, to get to a situation. And today when we're talking about active shooter scenarios, uh, a school shooting, I hate to use that terminology, but in that situation, we don't have six hours. We have now. And this is going to even the odds for us to make sure that the public is safe and that we can do our jobs. Chief Perry Batchelor says the carbine is another asset for members to ensure public and officer safety. Fifteen years ago, we had a marijuana grow up in the RM. Uh, that grow up was very sophisticated. Uh, there was uh, closed circuit television on it. This is 15 years ago. When we got inside, the first thing inside the door was a loaded HK with 100 rounds in magazines ready to rock. On that call, I actually called before we entered onto that property and I borrowed rifles. He goes on to explain that the carbine is a far more accurate means of dealing with a threat outside of what would be considered a safe distance with a pistol or a shotgun. A pistol at close range is a very effective, accurate weapon. But once you start getting back to 25, 50, certainly 100 yards, the pistol is totally ineffective. So it's, it's about accuracy, and you want accuracy because you don't want collateral damage. Bachelor stresses that while the rifle is a lethal option on the department's use of force continuum, police officers will have to carefully consider its use before deployment. The plan is to eventually have all eight members of the Altona Police Service trained to use the carbines. For Pemina Valley Online, I'm Candace Dirksen.